Hi, this is Ashley Eckstein, voice of Ahsoka Tano, and thank you for listening to the Super Awesome Geek Show. My friends, my friends! <laughs> hey, hey! Today we have the one-sixth scale Yoda Hot Toys from Sideshow. This thing, I've been waiting for this. This is cool. I've actually, it was supposed to come in March. <laughs> I paid for it 100% way back like a year or so ago and it was supposed to show up in March and I finally got mine and it was crazy because I know other people who ordered this and they ordered it after I did. I, I The day this went on sale, I bought it and paid it 100% full up front and I know people who waited like six months later and then bought it and they got theirs in March. And I had to wait till July to get mine. <laughs> so I guess they do last come first serve. <laughs> like, <laughs> when they when they give the stuff away, not not first come first serve. It's it's last come la first served. So um, yeah, but uh, I'm so happy that it's finally here. This is really cool. Is this actually a hot toy or maybe it's just a sideshow six scale figure? I I don't see the hot toy logo on it, but um I had to get a premium Yoda figure because it's Yoda and I you know how can my collection not have a premium Yoda figure in it? I mean, jeez, come on. Extra feet and um I don't know what they cup onto, but they, they look like they're they sit on your finger or something. Lightsaber, a cane, and Yoda's dressed in plastic here. And then we have on the bottom, we got a stand and six hands. A stand and six hands. So the stand is uh, a wire going into a base. I don't know what that's how that's going to work, but we'll see. We'll check it out. And then, uh, let's get Yoda out here. All right. Here's Yoda just as he comes right outside the box. He is about six inches tall. Um, so he's, I, which I, if you do one sixth scale, that would make him almost three feet tall. And Yoda's only two foot, two inches tall. So He's not quite one six scale. <laughs> He's a little bit bigger than six scale, but I like the size of him. Um, I'm very happy with having a deluxe figure this size, even if he isn't to scale with other things in the line. Um, but uh, I, I really, yeah, I'm very happy with him at the size he's at. The cloth robes and outfit work really well and look really well, really good. He's got um, head movement to the left and right. A little bit of up and down movement here. I want to be very careful with him, so I'm not jamming his movements that much. I don't want these... The last thing I want is one of these things to break. So I'm being very careful with him here. Um, shoulder joints. Standard shoulder joints. It's a ball and pinion. And uh, moves all around. We got an elbow joint. There's some twist in the upper arm. There you go. And uh, hand move around and there's hand bend. So lots of movement in the arms and hands to give you a lot of poses. He's got some twist in the body and some up and down in the body. So uh, you could do a lot of dynamic poses. The legs and knee joints bend and there's a twist in there. And we have the feet joints, which move up and down and twist around as well. So, basically the same movement you would find in a Black Series or any 6-inch action figure. Um, any Hot Toy or any Sideshow toy that you've got. It's that, that same kind of movement, you know. So Yoda has a hole in the back of the brown outfit. His brown jumpsuit has a hole in it. There's a Star Wars stand that it comes with. And this 
can go right through that hole into a hole in his body. He, he has a hole in his body, Yoda does. And then he'll float. So I I can I I'm a little put off by there's no stand for when he's just supposed to be standing on the ground. The stand is really only used for air when he's in the air. Let's let's change these feet. We'll mess with that stand in a little bit, I think. We'll try to get some kind of flying Jedi action pose, but uh Changing the feet is fairly easy. It's just a ball joint. You pop it on there. Seems to work all right. Again, I don't know what this cupped. It's the size of your finger, so you could, you know, he could sit on your finger. Maybe there was a deluxe stand, and those went with the deluxe stand somehow. I, I just, I must not have got the deluxe version. I bet there was a deluxe with a, some kind of stand, and those feet worked with that stand. And then we have some hands here. I'm going to use one of these hands. Let's see how easy it is to change them. Oh, very, very nice. Very easy. And uh, this one, I'll, I'll, I'll put the lightsaber in his hand. Because I'm... I don't want to put the accessories away, so I'm going to show... When I put him up on my shelf, he's going to have the lightsaber and the cane in his hand. I'm not sure about the stand yet. Let's let's see. Like you can do this. I'm so terrible. I need Vern to make like a really good pose here or something cuz I'm trying to use the stand and keep him balanced and do some kind of flying jump lightsaber attack. Yeah. But now, for me, I think I'm going to do it this way. I'll put the cane in one hand, the lightsaber in the other, and he'll be just sort of standing there as if he just walked up with his cane and he's ready to, you know, judge me by my size, do you? And so you should not. <laughs> for my ally is the Force, and a powerful ally it is. <laughs> uh. Yeah, this is from the Clone Wars. This is that's why he's very anime looking. He's very animation style, and uh, I think this works for an animated style of of Yoda. Let's turn this light off and put him more in the center. There we go. The cloak, the the white cloak, is a little bit posable. I don't, I couldn't feel a wire in there, but it sure does act like there was a wire in there. You know, like I could flail it out when he was jumping in the air and it sort of stayed where I put it. So it's, it's got some rigidity to it and, but yeah, it almost acts like there's a wire in there, but I couldn't find a wire in there. So, um, but it's pretty cool. I, I, I like this guy all the way around. Let me know what you guys think of this Yoda, Yoda sideshow. Six scale action figure. Thanks a lot for watching, guys. I appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoyed taking a look at him with me. He's going right on the premium shelf with the stormtroopers and all the other guys. All right. Stay awesome out there, everybody. I'll talk to you on the next one. See you.